Coming up, Loot Crate asks us to explore the many ways to play. from TTFXC here with February's Crate. This time around, the theme is play, and Loot Crate has hinted that the crate will be filled with items that will explore the different types of games we like to play. If you're new to Loot Crate, Loot Crate is a monthly mystery subscription box geared towards the geek and gaming culture. Each month, based on a theme, they will fill the crate with six to eight items ranging from new company products, game gear, apparel, snacks, toys, and art. I'll leave everything you need to know about this subscription service in the description below. And as always, I'll be including a quick breakdown at the end of this video for those curious about the costs and value for what we're about to discover in this month's crate. Well, I've been reading a lot of mixed reviews about this month's theme, so time to find out what's inside this month's Loot Crate Play Crate. I've always meant to buy the larger version of this kid robot art toy. The basic idea is you can customize the money with whatever washable medium you wish to use and simply reset or customize when you want to start again. Loot Crate is actually holding a contest right now for the most creative customized money. It's a shame really, Loot Crate often sends us these custom posters. Some like this one, which I actually like, tend to arrive so wrinkled that they are hardly worth mounting. Still, a fun idea if they ever get the delivery part down right. Well, here we go again. Loot Crate has sent us several micro hex bugs in the past couple of years. And I actually got the Scarab Hexbug in my Vsauce crate over the holidays. Looks like I will now have the Hexbug Ant to add to my army of cat toys. One of the things that for me I like about Loot Crate is the fact that they do often include novels like this one in their crates. I've heard mixed reviews about this story. Now I'll get a chance to decide for myself if it's worth the read. Super Fight is another fun card game based on fights between characters with superpowers and yes, super problems. Basically, you argue with your friends on which of your fighters could win. To quote the creators, think of this card game as apples to apples meets cards against humanity. Then after they meet, they fight to the death. Pretty cool rock, paper, scissors, die are meant to be used with or without the customized board game that Loot Crate printed on the inside of this month's crate.
on this month's review useful, and as promised, here's a breakdown of what we found in this month's booth crate. Our prices are estimates based on what we were able to find online the day of this review. As always, a quick shout out, a thanks to everyone that has subscribed, commented, or given us a thumbs up, and yes, even a thumbs down for any of our videos. We really enjoy the interaction and look forward to reading what you thought about this month's crate in the comments below. Let us know if there's something you would like to see us add or review. I'm always on the lookout for new ideas for the channel. Check out the end slate annotations for some of our other videos and reviews. Until next time, happy collecting everyone from PPFXC.